Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming here with another episode of Skyrim. Alright, we left off. We finally captured Oriel's bow from the clutches of Virther, the Arch Curate. And, man, it's a pretty little thing. Let's just zoom in and get a good look at that. Oh, that's beautiful. That is a gorgeous design. That just looks great. Alright. Now, we have to talk to Serana real quick, real quick, kip tip -ter, real quick, so that way we can figure out what we're supposed to do with it. She might have an inkling. It's not as shiny as I was expecting. Still, okay. it's beautiful. It is. Now I'm wondering what you were expecting, to be perfectly honest. What do we do now? I think we both know. It's time to face my father. Yes, it if is. If we don't, he'll keep chasing us for the rest of our lives. And yours will be significantly more longer than mine, so that doesn't seem appealing. Uh, if we do, he'll have to die. You're aware of that. I've been thinking about this for a long time. It's... It's not easy. But I don't think we have much of a choice. Yeah. No. This has to end here and now. You're, you're right. You're absolutely right. And I'm glad that you're able to see reason. Let's face him, together. If we head back to the castle and kick the front door in, we're gonna be knee-deep in his friends. That's true. Let's head back to Isran and let him see what we've got first. I'm betting he'll lend us a sword or two. Yeah, I'm sure. And a couple axes, and a few maces and war hammers. I'm probably sure. I'm sure he'll do that. But uh, first, If there's Gelibor. anything at all I can help you with, please ask. What can you tell me about Oriel's bow? The bow was said to be carried by Oriel himself into battle against the forces of Lorcan in ancient and mythic times. Ah. Its craftsmanship has no equal anywhere within Tamriel, and possibly beyond. So it's a big old magical god bow. Okay, I gotcha. It's a god of bow. <laughs> That's a bad joke. <laughs> what can it do? The bow draws its power from Aetherius itself, channeling it through the sun. Mm. Therefore, when an arrow is loosed from the bow, it produces a magical effect very similar to being burned by fire. Oh, so it seems like... Any arrow loosed from it would be like holding the sun in the palm of your hands and just burning all you see with it. That actually does sound kind of fun. Sounds powerful. That's actually only a fraction of its potential. Alrighty. With sun-hallowed arrows, you would be able to produce a much more spectacular effect. Really? Causing bursts of sunlight to envelop your foes. Ooh. The sun bursts would certainly hurt anything, but is especially devastating to the undead. That is... that does sound very true, actually. Berther said something about using blood. Well, using an arrow with the bow that's been dipped in blood may cause it to function differently, Probably. corrupting its purpose. That's, of course, if you're foolish enough to try it. Seems like Berther was definitely foolish enough, considering he tried to kill us both just to do it. So what will happen to the Chantry now? Why it would fill me with joy to see the Chantry back to its former glory. That time has long since passed. Fair enough. Now that my brother's dead, it's quite possible I'm the last of our kind. Oh, that sucks. Then I've contributed to your kind's extinction. And now I feel bad. <laughs> There's no need for that kind of talk. I said it was possible. Okay. It's also quite possible that there are some other isolated conclaves of snow elves nestled elsewhere on Nern. I'll also assume Vertha didn't exactly give you the option to stay your hand. True. Very true. And I guess you could be right, and I'd feel a little better if that was the case, but so far we haven't seen that yet. So what will you do then, I guess? For the time being, I will remain here, on the Overlook, and continue trying to keep the Sanctum free of the betrayed. Fair enough. You're always welcome to return here at any time, of course. Sure. I will definitely do that, if only to get those sun-hallowed arrows you were talking about. But can the betrayed ever be cured? I feel nothing but sympathy for the betrayed, despite my actions against them. All right. But I'm afraid that they're well beyond a cure at this point. Why? The I twisted mean, forms why, but... you've seen didn't occur overnight. Yeah. It isn't a plague or a disease that ravaged our species. The dwarves may have stolen their sight, but it took many generations for them to become what they are today. That is true. Quite a lot of evolution occurred between when they lost their sight and now, so of course they've 
basically become very twisted and vile just on their own accord, so that does make sense. You're not wrong. And apparently, neither am I. <laughs> then there's no hope for them. Perhaps they'll never return to their former appearance. But over uh. the centuries, I've noticed a rise in their intellect. Really? If a line of communication could be established with them, maybe they can find peace. Hopefully. It's the only way they'll discover that they weren't always malignant. They were once a proud and prosperous race. That does sound good. Very... What's the word? Idealistic. There we go. It's funny, I forget the word, and I used to consider myself that as a kid. Alright. How do I obtain sun hallowed arrows, now that I think about I it? I can actually assist you in that regard. Really? If you were to bring me some good quality elven arrows, mm -hmm. I could imbue them with the proper incantations and rituals. Fair enough. I'm pretty sure I have quite a fuck ton. So, can you make me some more? Absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. All right. So if you want the rest of your arrows blessed, let me know. Fair enough. Absolutely. More. I can only do 20 at a He's time. going to do that line so every time, isn't it? So the rest of your arrows blessed. Yeah, I have a feeling. Absolutely. Yeah. I can only... Does the Absolutely. full line the entire can... time. Absolutely. I can only... Right. Absolutely. Am I almost done I yet? Only... Absolutely. I can only done? do 20 Ooh, at a time. Looks like I'm actually so done almost. So if you want almost. the rest of your arrows, certainly. I can only do 20 at a time, but I see that won't be a problem in this case. That's good. Finally done with it. Farewell, friend. May the radiance of Oriel fill your heart with joy. Same to you, my friend. Same to you. All right, Sorana. Sorana, you were sitting in my view the entire time, walking around Galibor, and now I can't find you? You doof. Okay. What now? Uh, are you ready to do this? Uh, are you ready to do this? I don't think you can ever be ready to kill your parents. That's probably true. I'm doing my best to not think of him as my father anymore. Let me know if you need anything. We've got enough to worry about right now. You stay focused, and I'll worry about me. Fair enough. But if you ever need anything, let me know. Alright. Let us get going. Right now we have to head all the way back to the other side of the damn province. To go back to Ezrin's little castle here. Yeah, to uh, Fort Dongard. There we go. Alrighty. We continue on, and we find out if we're actually able to do this. Should equip the bow before I head there, because I'm going to forget. Also, should probably hit a shopkeeper to unload, well, all my shit. Because <laughs> I have quite a fuck ton of it. Alright. I could probably use someone in the uh, fort, now that I think about it. First, let's equip the bow. There we are. And it automatically equipped the arrows. Nice. All right. Let's get the hell in here. Why is the door semi-ajar? Did something happen? Was it fort attacked? Do I need to kill a bunch of vampires right now? No, I don't think so. <laughs> uh, give it a moment. Ah, these load screens. I mean, I know it's better on the computer, but... Eh, I don't know if my little laptop can handle it. I don't have a beast of a computer yet. Planning on building one, but it's not in the meantime. I am too busy trying to get out on my own first. Hey! Dexian! Well, I'll leave you to whatever you're doing. First, I need to see... Our little vendor people, which should be over here. Serene. Hope you're Serene. getting along with Isron. Hopefully. It takes some getting used to. I think I am. I like what Isron has done with the place. It's good mm -hmm. to see someone else who's really prepared. Fair enough. What do you have for sale? If I'll buy whatever you're have her do to get it. rid of. There we go. I hit the button and it didn't go. All right. Let's see what you got that I can use. Ooh, that I can use. Uh, Petty Soul Gem. Not exactly what I'm looking for, but I could probably use that. Uh, let's see. Spell Tome Sunfire. I'm pretty sure I have that. Uh, let me look at your potions. All miners, really. That came out weird. <laughs> let's see what else. Uh, yeah, got weird stuff going on my 
back of my neck. It's like itching. It's bugging me. Okay. Oh, I can get a whole bunch more elven arrows. That would have been nice to know earlier. Uh, can't really do anything right now, though. Uh, dwarven bolts. Use that as an excuse to boost your money so I can sell you more shit. Let's sell that, that. Ice spikes, icy spear. Oh, shit, you don't have enough money for that. Oh, no. I'm keeping these. I'm keeping these. They aren't going anywhere. Uh, necklace of extreme health as opposed to... What else do I have health on? I don't have anything with health. Ooh. That's not good. But then again, I could probably enchant my stuff with health once I get the two perk uh, effect, which was twin souls, I think. I don't know. I No, that's conjuration. <laughs> I'm a doof. All right. I think that got the majority of my weight down. There we go. There we go. And there we go. All right. Uh, let's see. All right, thank you ever so much. I wasn't planning on it, but now that you put the idea in my head, I'm a little frightened. Oh, that's significantly lower than where it was before. Uh, that, it's not great, but it's better than where it started. I'll consider that good. Yes. You have Oriel's bow. Yeah, I have it right on my back, actually. I heard actually. it described in tales, but I could never have imagined its beauty. Well, apparently Serana doesn't think it's that beautiful, so I'm well, whatever. But <laughs> anyway, we need your help. Indeed. Mm -hmm. The day hasn't been won while Harkon still walks Tamriel. That is true. But what of Serana? What is Dexian doing? Can she be trusted to lift a blade against her own kind? Her own family? To be fair, I do trust her to do the right thing. I suppose that's as much as I can hope for. That's Let me the address the need. Dawn Guard and then we'll be off. The men deserve to know that we finally gained the upper hand. Fair enough. Everyone, gather round. Seems that Come they're on, all then. eating over we there. Got all day. Dexian, what in the hell are you doing? You have... Has your blindness finally made you crazy too? <laughs> Good lord, okay. Alrighty, now they're all gathered here for a thing. Or not all. Oh, there's this guy. Uh... Agmar! Agmar, or something. Got one more person waiting over there. Oh, there, there. Okay, I think we got all of them. Serana, let's just sit here and wait while they pep For themselves too long, up. We've allowed these vampires to poison the night and kill our people. Now, we finally have the means to strike back. Right here. We now have Ariel's bow. The gods themselves have favored us. And we must answer with action. Yeah. The time has come to finally put an end to Harkon and his unholy prophecy. We will march on their lair and destroy those wretched abominations so they can no longer corrupt our world. <laughs> this is our fight. And this is our fate. This is the time of the Dawn Guard. <laughs> those are the only two that are actually at all psyched. Oh, there we go. There we go, the rest of them are going. Send the, troll after them. Send the troll after them. It's time we take the fight to their door. Yes, it is. Gather your things and rest well, my friend. We meet outside Castle Pokahar. Rest? I don't need rest. I'm going right the fuck now. Uh, what that? I don't need anything Watch with that. We'll do that. Serana, yes. are you ready to do this now? Just leave me alone for now. I'll be fine. Okay, I'm just making sure you're good. Let's get going and take the fight to Harkon. All right. All right, let's get us going. It's gonna... <laughs> I had to deal with a load screen first, so now the uh, psychage is kind of ebbing a little bit. But I'm ready to go. Hell yeah. Fucking something Macho Man Randy Savage said for a second. <laughs> Oh yeah! We're gonna put these arrows right into Hawkon's face and make him eat the power of the sun! Oh yeah! I really should stop. 
It's a little too much on my part. <laughs> All right, now we'll fast travel there, and everyone else should be with us once we hit there. Oh, Dragon Scale. Not going to be doing much with that, but uh, eventually. Speaking of which, we will need to do Daedric stuff very soon. <laughs> I'll need to boost up the uh, level that we got for that in smithing. That'll take a fuck ton of time. There we are. Oh, look them all filtering. <laughs> all right. Ready to go, he's run. Whoops. The armor troll got They're in the way. done with this when none of them are left standing. Let's go. Fair enough. Let's do it. What do we got going on? Where's the rest of them? I have a feeling these are gargoyles that'll pop as soon as I get there. Yeah! That was, that was the case. Ooh. Not really doing that much damage to the brutes, but let's see if it'll do a lot of damage to uh, vampires here. That's amazing. Oh! Okay, I really should not be doing the uh, long range route, apparently. <laughs> because that doesn't work for me. Uh, then I guess I'll have to do close range and pop a lot of potions and food. <sighs> I'll have to do the long range route when I, we're fighting Harkon. Okay, I was hoping I'd get to see what kind of damage I could get on vampires, but it's a fine, it's fine, it's whatever. I, mean, I am doing expert, so it won't be that much, I think. At least I think I am. Let me double check that real quick. Uh, settings, gameplay, adept. Really? I swear I was on expert. Huh, that's yeah, great. <laughs> and that just makes that all the more sad. Okay, uh, let's pop back to all the way back and get this fight going one more time. And this time not die like an idiot. <laughs> that would be very, very detrimental to actually finishing this fight. All right. Drink the soda, there we go. And now we just wait for the load screen to end. <laughs> there we go. Uh, let's actually pop. <laughs> Came in in T form. <laughs> That's hilarious. There it goes. Alright, now let's pop the food. Uh, Where is the food I want? Yeah, there we go. Uh, vegetable soup. Yeah, that'll work. And potion. Which potion do I want? Uh, elixir of health? That would be actually very useful. So we'll do that. Um, buggery. What else? Regeneration would be nice. Yeah, that would be very nice. Uh, yeah, we'll do that one. And we'll poison the bow. Simply. Not the bow. Yeah. Sword. Simply so we get the first strike on someone and be damaging. Now let's go! Onwards! To defeat Harkon! This one, guys, gonna pop out. Oh, he was hit. Damn it. Now oh, that didn't work out like I wanted to do. Okay. Take out the dogs. Take out the people. Okay. This is really going badly for me for me in particular uh potion of healing that'll do there we go okay that worked oh geez that guy is casting a whole bunch of really high level ice spells that's not doing good for me uh do i have anything for that i do nor a whole bunch of that All right, I think we got that guy now. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay, my health is just dying really quickly. Holy shit. Um, magic, that would actually be good in general. And I'm really running out of health potions. Good lord. Uh, 
fuck. Where's my, uh... There it is. Ultimate, there we go. Perfect. And... I'll show your head. There we go, perfect. Alright. Uh, should I really waste time looting them? I don't think it'll help that much. Uh... Fuck it, I'll do it. Simply because I earned it. For Gunmar... For Dongar in Skyrim. I thought he said Gunmar. And I'm like, huh? Who the fuck is Gunmar? Uh, let me look at this guy. Ooh. Want that. Want that. Want that. And, eh. <laughs> what happened to the other guy? Did he just... Oh, these guys just fell down here. Just rolled down to here. I'll take that. Why would he have cooked beef? Isn't he a vampire? That makes no sense. I'll just take all that. There we go. Oh. Alright, upwards we go. And yeah, I think that's the rest of them. We're good. I, that seemed like more enemies than actually was there for the bodies. Alright, now we assault the keep. Well, it's not really a keep. It's more like the inner sanctum of the castle. Close enough, close enough. Alright. Loading screen. Hurry the fuck up. We're supposed to be, you know, psyched up and ready to, for battle. Come on. Give me something here. Just twisting my nipples, loading screen. Just twisting them. Huh? There we go. All right. These guys, take care of the rest of this. Love mouth. Take Come here, help off. There we go. Let the troll take care of the rest of you. All right. Oh, jeez. There's so many particle effects going on here. Oh, Joel. There you go. You're dead. And... Oh, you're dead. Oh, jeez. Let's take care of this guy over here. Okay. You are not too happy. I'm not too happy with you. You're going to die, buddy. <laughs> All right. Where's the next guy? Uh, Garan Marithi. Sorry, Dark Elf. You're gonna die. Yep, you're gone. <laughs> oh, jeez, my health is gone. Good lord. Uh, Fire Breath. I do have that equipped. Nice. Uh, should probably heal myself first. Uh, ultimate healing. That'll do it. Alright, there we go. Take care of this guy, and I'll go to your head. <laughs> Alright, perfect. And, what do we got going on? Do we have any other bodies? No, we do not. Uh, take what you got. Eh, I can sell those, at the very least. Uh, steal that, or we could just leave it there. And not be threatened by the Dawn Guard. I don't know if that'll actually be a thing. I've never seen that glitch, but I would rather not risk it. <laughs> to be perfectly... Let's see this guy. Yeah, let's just... These guys do not seem to have much, but I'd rather check them. Yeah, they do not have much at all, if anything. So. Oh! I guess the troll died. That's kind of sad. But at the same time to be expected, considering that he was fighting an actual vampire. Like, full up. Oh, what is this? Potion of blood. Yeah, that doesn't seem like it'll be useful to us. Yeah, you took quite a few bolts there to take you down. Well, take the ale. Eh, okay. And that... Kassith. Oh, a Sith in the name. I feel bad. To be fair, I think they're all dead, so I think we're good. <laughs> Calm down there, Durak. Okay, I think we're good. And he's Ron. Need to head up there. Dawn Guard. Yes. Let us go. The cathedral. It's the next step of this whole thing. I have a feeling this is where Harkon's gonna be. Yep. So. Serana, my darling. Oops. I see you still favor keeping a pet. Oi! You know why we're here. I may be a cat, but come on. Of I'm gonna quip the bow here. Real quick. There we are. Of course I do. You disappoint me, Serana. 
You've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for provided. this pathetic being. Provided for me? Are you insane? You've destroyed our happy. family. You've killed other vampires all over some prophecy that we barely understand. No more. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Fair enough. Your voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. How alike you've become. No. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. Yeah, that's and Serana. you. Fuck yeah, me. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I'll go fuck yourself. I knew it was only a matter of time before she'd return with hatred in her heart. Didn't need my influence on that. Hatred born of your neglect. A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. Ah! Bullshit. Your kind is a blight on this world. Yes, yes. Always the noble vampire hunter. Ah, just and you. And what happens when you've slain me? Is Valerica next? Is Serana? Absolutely not. I will never harm Serana. She's too important to me. <laughs> then my daughter is truly lost. She died the moment she accepted a mortal into her life. Well, she keeps wanting to resharpen her sword over there from the sound of it. Enough of this. Yes, quite. I'm growing weary of speaking to you and my traitorous daughter. I'll give you a single really? chance to turn over the bow to me. There will not be a second. Really? Never? Very well then. You leave me no choice. I'll okay. Well, I was not expecting that. I should probably pop this onto my hot bar then. There we go. Uh, so that way I can re-switch to it after I take out his minions here. Gargoyle, you're gone. There we go. And back up to the bow. There we go. Where's he gonna go from there? Okay, jeez, he keeps flying around, but I can't even hit him really. I'm bad with bows in general. Why did they expect me to do this? Oh jeez. At least it just creates some sort of explosive effect, so. There we go. Now we gotta hit on him. Or he just keeps running around. Some <laughs> hit with so many of her ice bolts at this point. I can't do a damn thing. Okay. He got close to me, and now I can just shoot this point blank in his face. Probably a bad choice on this part. Oh geez. You go now. Oh. that every time he does that. Really? Invulnerable now? Okay, that'll work. How many arrows do I still have left? 150 of them. Okay. Okay. Will it now? Don't think you understand. Where would he go? Okay, he's up there. Destroying spell after spell at this point. Ah! Oh. I was not paying attention to my health. I was paying attention to try and get him. I'm going to end the episode here for right now because apparently that fight is going to kill me quite a bit. <laughs> and I'd rather finish it off in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. So click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. It can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games for you.